Hello students, so we shall continue solving problems related to Maclaurin series expansion. Maclaurin series expansion is given by y of x equals y of 0 plus x y 1 of 0 plus x square by 2 factorial y 2 of 0 and so on. Right? So now let us expand a power x using Maclaurin series expansion up to 3 terms. So y of x equals a of x. So put x equal to 0. So when you put x equal to 0, we have y of 0 is a power 0 which is 1. Now what is y1 of x? You differentiate y of x with respect to x. So y1 of x is differential of a power x is a power x log a. Right? So now we have to put x equal to 0. So y1 of 0 equals a power 0 log a which is log a itself. Right? So a power 0 is 1, 1 into log a is log a. Now what is y1 of x? So y1 of x is written as y1. So for simplicity we will write y1 of x as y1, y2 of x as y2 and so on. Now observe y1 is nothing but a power x. a power x is nothing but y into log a. So now you differentiate this again with respect to x. So you get y2 equals y1 log a. Now put x equal to 0. So what is y2 of 0? It is y1 of 0 log a. y1 of 0 is nothing but log a. So you have log a into log a which is log a square. So y1 of 0 is log a. So let me write the values y of 0 is 1, y1 of 0 is log a and what is y2 of 0? It is again log a the whole square. So differentiate this expression again. So y3 equals y2 log a. So put x equal to 0. So y3 of 0 is nothing but y2 of 0 log a. But y2 of 0 is log a square. So this is log a the whole cube. So this is y3 of 0 and so on. So substitute all these values in the general expression. So y of x is a power x equals y of 0 is 1 plus x into y1 of 0 is log a plus x square by 2 factorial log a the whole square plus x cubed by 3 factorial is 6, 2 factorial is 2, log a the whole cube and so on. Next question, using Maclaurin series expand log secant x up to x power 5. So we have to proceed up to x power 5. So we have y equals log secant x. So what is y of 0? Put x equal to 0. So you have log of secant 0. Secant 0 is 1. Log 1 is 0. So y of 0 is 0 here. So let me write the values. So y of 0 is 0. Next, y1. So y1 of x is being written as y1 equals differential of log secant x. So it is 1 by secant x into differential of secant x is secant x tan x. So secant x gets cancelled. So y1 is nothing but tan x. So y1 of 0. So when you put x equal to 0, you get tan 0. So what is tan 0? It is 0. So y1 of 0 equals 0 again. Next, y2 equals. So differentiate this with respect to x. So differential of y1 is y2. Differential of tan x is secant square x. So y2 of 0 equals secant square 0 which is 1. So we get the first non-zero value y2 of 0 equals 1. Now to continue further, instead of differentiating this expression, let me make a few changes. y2 equals secant square x is nothing but 1 plus tan squared x. And we know that tan x is y1. So this is nothing but 1 plus y1 square. So therefore, y2 equals 1 plus y1 square. So we differentiate this again so that it becomes easier. So differentiate this. So differential of y2 is y3 equals differential of 1 is 0. 
2 y1 y2 so what is y3 of 0 it is 2 into y1 of 0 is 0 okay so this is nothing but 0 here right y1 of 0 is 0 so with respect to y2 y3 of 0 becomes equal to 0 so y3 of 0 is 0 next what is y4 2 y1 y3 plus 2 y2 into y2 so y4 of 0 is 2 into y1 of 0 is 0 so i get 0 here plus 2 into what is y2 of 0 it is 1 so 1 into 1 so y4 of 0 is nothing but 2 so y4 of 0 is 2 next to get y5 of 0 differentiate this with respect to x so you have y5 equals to y1 y4 plus 2 y3 differential of y1 is y2 plus 2 you have y2 square so this is nothing but 2 y2 square so 2 into 2 y2 y3 so you have 2 y1 y4 plus this is 2 y2 y3 this is 4 y2 y3 so it's 6 y2 y3 this is y5 so put x equal to 0 so you have y5 of 0 equals 2 into y1 of 0 is 0 plus 6 into what is y2 of 0 it is 1 y3 of 0 is 0 so y5 of 0 is also 0 so we have to find the series expansion up to x power 5 so we have found all the five values ranging from y1 of 0 to y5 of 0 so now let us substitute the values in the Maclaurin series expansion so log secant x equals y of 0 is 0 plus y1 of 0 is 0 plus y2 of 0 is 1 so it is x square by 2 into 1 plus 0 plus y4 of 0 it's x power 4 divided by 4 factorial 2, 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 into 2 so 2 and 2 gets cancelled so finally the expression is x square by 2 plus x power 4 by 12 so this is log secant x now this is a very interesting problem we have to expand tan inverse x in ascending powers of x and finally show that pi equals 4 into 1 minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 and so on so of course we have to use Maclaurin series expansion so y equals tan inverse x so therefore y of 0 is tan inverse of 0 which is 0 so y of 0 is 0 what is y1 differential of tan inverse x is 1 divided by 1 plus x square so y1 of 0 is 1 divided by 1 which is 1 again so y1 of 0 equals 1 now we have to differentiate this expression further so let me take this term in the denominator to lhs so i get y1 into 1 plus x square equals 1 so we differentiate this expression equation 1 so y1 into differential of this is 2x plus 1 plus x square into differential of y1 is y2 equal to 0. So put x equal to 0 in this expression. So you get 0 plus this is 0. So y2 of 0 is also equal to 0. So you get y2 of 0 is 0. next differentiate this expression again so you have 2x y2 plus 2 y1 plus first function into differential of second function plus y2 into 2x equals 0 so put x equal to 0 so this term becomes 0 plus 2 into y1 of 0 is 1 so y1 of 0 is 1 plus x is 0 right so you have 1 into y3 of 0 plus x is 0 here equal to 0. So you have y3 of 0 plus 2 equal to 0. So y3 of 0 equals minus 2. So we have y3 of 0 
equals minus 2. So we have to proceed further. Now this expression can further be simplified as you have 2y1 plus 1 plus x square y3 plus here you have 2xy2 2xy2 so it is 4xy2 equal to 0. So this is the expression which we will be differentiating further. Now differentiating this expression you have 2y2 plus first function into differential of y3 is y4 plus y3 into differential of this expression is 2x plus 4xy3 plus 4y2 equals 0. Right, so let me just simplify this. You have 1 plus x square y4 plus, see here you have 2x y3, 4x y3. So it is 6x y3 plus 4y2 plus 2y2, 6y2 equals 0. So put x equal to 0 in this expression. So you get y4 of 0 plus 0. x is 0 here plus y2 of 0 is 0 equal to 0. So y4 of 0 is also equal to 0. So you have y4 of 0 equals 0. Next to get y5 of 0 differentiate this again 1 plus x square y5 plus y4 into 2x plus 6xy4 plus 6y3 into differential of x is 1 plus 6y3 equals 0. Now you have 1 plus x square into y5 plus this is 2xy4, 6xy4. So it is 8xy4 plus 6y3, 6y3 is 12y3 equals 0. Now put x equal to 0 here. So what do we get? y5 of 0 plus x is 0, so this is 0 plus 12. What is y of 0? y3 of 0 is minus 2. So this is minus 24 taken to the other side becomes plus 24. So y5 of 0 equals 24. So we have y5 of 0 equals 24. So we'll stop here and we will put these values in the Maclaurin series expansion and see what we get. So y of x is tan inverse x equals y of 0 is 0 plus x into y1 of 0 is 1 so it is 1 plus 0 plus you have x cube by 3 factorial into minus 2 plus y4 of 0 is 0 plus y5 of 0 is 24 right so it's y x bar 5 divided by 5 factorial into 24 so let's try to simplify this so it is x minus so 3 factorial now can be written as 2 into 3 so 2 2 gets cancelled so it is minus x cube by 3 similarly 5 factorial is nothing but 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 so 4 3s are 12 12 into 2 is 24 so 24 24 gets cancelled so we get x power 5 by this is tan inverse x. Now what do we need? We need this expression. Now how do we get this? Now we know that tan inverse 1 is pi by 4. So tan inverse 1 is pi by 4. So let me put x equal to 1 in this expression. So tan inverse 1 is pi by 4 equals x is 1. So 1 minus x cube is 1 cube so it is 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 and so on so take 4 to the other side so pi equals 4 into 1 minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 and so on so this is what we have to show right so what you need to do is you need to expand tan inverse x and then you need to substitute all the values what you get here y of 0 y1 of 0 up to y5 of 0 in the Maclaurin series expansion you get this expansion and remember at hs you need pi by 4 and we know that tan inverse 1 is pi by 4 so put x equal to 1 you get pi by 4 on the lhs and wherever x is there you put x equal to 1 
So you get pi by 4 equals 1 minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5. And then you take 4 to the other side. So you get pi equals 4 into this expression. So this is what had to be proved. So this was part 2 of McLaurin series expansion where we have taken 3 examples. So in the next video segment we shall see a few examples on Taylor series expansion. So do not forget to like, share and subscribe and press the bell icon to get notifications of all the further uploads and thanks for watching.